Today we're going to do a clutch install, clutch kit install on a 700 EFI Rhino. First step is you have to disconnect the coil pack from the frame. Just these two wires. You gotta remove the cross support. Pull the plastic piece out of the way, get at the cross member mount, and then the cross member comes out. Swing that out of the way. Take your coil off so you can remove your cross member. your snorkel tube. Take the front bracket off to get to the clutch. Take your clutch guard off. Once you get all the screws taken out, pry apart the clutch halves. You're going to mark your clutch for phase so you put it back together the same way. And pull your spider out. Pudding. Take your weight rollers out, the stock rollers. Notice the colors of these. These are color coded. Some kits will have mixed match rollers and we'll stagger them in the pockets together. If they do are mis mismatched, we'll either go side by side with each color or crisscross from each other. Okay, put your spider back in, make sure it's all in phase. And then you can put your cover back on. Make sure your o ring stays in place. Go ahead and put your screws all back in and cinch them up nice and tight. Take the retaining nut off your driven clutch, move the fan on the clutch itself. You want to bust that nut loose before you put it in the compression tool. Take the pressure off the cap, and you can spin the nut off with your fingers. Install your new spring and the compression tool. Down, tight seats, and then thread your nut. And 
install your secondary. Make sure the rollers are pushed all the way down so this cap won't slide back up. You might have to do tighten that nut on a vise to get the timing marks to line up. You use the screw that's included to back out your driven sheet to install your belt. Put your belt on your drive clutch first and then roll it around into your driven. You can back out that bolt and reinstall your guards. You reassemble your outboard support, your drive clutch. Put in your clutch cover. Make sure you put the short screws in the right spot. Right there. Reinstall your snorkel. Install your cross frame member. Install your front seat mount. Reinstall your plastic covers.